Well, we're also used to just popping an ibuprofen, you know, to get the anti-inflammatory down. And what a natural way to do this. This is so much better. Well, the thing you know? is, is that you're actually creating change in the tissues themselves. Rather than addressing the symptom, which is the pain, mm -hmm. you're actually helping to relieve the muscular tension and the fascial tensions that are creating that pain. And um, one thing people don't most people don't understand how muscles really work. They have different spindles and they join together like this. And so when the muscle is lengthening, they pull apart and when they contract, they go together. Mm -hmm. So if they're contracted like this, and they, they sometimes they just get stuck there. So it's a really good thing if you can help them to lengthen out and it, it will reduce a lot of pain for a lot of people. Yeah, the body's such a magnificent tool how it tries to heal itself. Yes. You know, by doing things like that. Yes, yeah. yes. So this is great. Well, thank you, wow. I really enjoyed that. <laughs> oh good, Tina, I'm glad you enjoyed that. <laughs> yeah, it was really great. Um, and so obviously those can benefit from taking your class. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. And you have um, classes held at in St. Paul? Uh, yes, I have classes in St. Paul. Uh, coming up this winter and spring, I'll be having classes in uh, St. Paul, North St. Paul, South St. Paul, Richfield, Edina, and St. Louis Park. So I'm going to be getting around town a little bit, and I also am teaching in some businesses. Some corporations are starting to look at this as a way of preventing repetitive stress injuries among wow. their employees. So uh -huh. uh, that's exciting to be on the front end of bringing uh, these techniques to, to the general public and also to businesses and corporations. Wow. And to feel better every day, to know that you know you can take a five minute break. What did that take? Maybe seven minutes even? Not very yeah. long. <laughs> Not very long. Yeah. And the class really does involve techniques. Actually there's some techniques for the neck and shoulders in the class too. They're not oh. massage techniques but some of the movement techniques because the uh, nerve supply to the arms comes right through the neck here mm -hmm. and the nerves and the blood vessels come through here and so tension in the neck and shoulders can really impact uh, how your hands feel, and mm -hmm. so um, there are a couple simple movement techniques to relax the neck and the shoulders as well as the hands and the forearms. And once you learn the whole routine, you can do the entire thing in less than 15 minutes. Yeah. And uh, what? And just also use the various techniques here and there throughout the day to relieve strain for yourself. Mm -hmm. The techniques are powerful. Very. And you can get a husband and wife together so they can they do could each, work other. On each other. Because <laughs> it does feel better oh. when someone else does it. it sure. I do have to say it does. But I know even when I'm having some feet problems and I take my feet and massage them, but I didn't get any results like this. So yes. yeah, definitely everyone would benefit from this. Well, yeah. you know, like I said, um, almost everyone, we always <laughs> have to put that little yeah. qualifier, almost everyone, and um, anyone that's got medical conditions, we do encourage you to consult with your doctor before taking the class. We don't want to take any chances with anyone, so if you're being treated for a condition in the, especially related to the hands, wrists, or forearms, do, do check with your doctor. Okay, that's great, and of course, I'm sure that we have a lot of our viewers that definitely want to know where you offer this. Well, Tina, yeah, I offer it in several places in the Twin Cities metro area, mm -hmm. and I'm working with a lot of community education um, centers. And so you can find information about where to take the class at my website, which is www.handcareclass.com, and look for the public class page. You'll find a complete listing of all of the uh, upcoming classes. Also, if you don't find what you want there, you can send me an email and I'll send you registration information as it becomes available. Sure. So people, sometimes people want to take the class in an area where I'm not there yet, but mm -hmm. I might be soon. Okay. So uh, the class really is expanding and growing and we're seeing a lot of uh, positive response. The other place where I offer the class is through businesses. I'm getting more businesses and corporations that are interested in offering the class as a prevention mm -hmm. technique because of the prevalence of uh, repetitive stress injury in the workplace now. Sure. And what a great idea um, to bring you into the whole company. What the businesses are doing is they're having me come in and teach. The class is a two-hour class. Okay. And they're coming, yeah. having me come and teach the two-hour class. And I do limit class size to 10. So it is small groups of people that are sure. learning these techniques. But then they can uh, just continue them, not only through their working career, but throughout their lives to help to uh, prevent injury. Right. 
And that's such a great idea instead of someone not being able to type that day or work with their hands because their hands are so so, so sore, sore. Yeah. so sore, yeah. yes, and um, to, to get at this problem right up front, because mm -hmm. most people that get a diagnosed medical condition like carpal tunnel syndrome, they've been having pain for a long time and discomfort for a long time before they actually have a diagnosis. So just learning to relieve the, the tension in the hands right up front before it de actually develops into a condition that requires a surgical intervention, right. it's, it's, it's a great idea and it's very cost effective. Mm -hmm. And it feels good. Yeah. It and feels it's non-invasive. It's non-invasive. There's mm -hmm. no drugs. Right. You know. And what a great idea that a corporation would actually take the time out to care about its employees, to hire you, to have you come in mm -hmm. for a time so that they can learn these techniques. And because we are all society of, you know, on the computers a lot more. Yes. You know, and the typing with the carpal tunnels and those issues. Yes. What, that just shows... Um, an employee that the employer actually cares about them. You know, mm -hmm. Tina, I have been very impressed by the businesses that have contacted me because uh, they're very progressive thinking. You can tell that uh, that they saw this idea and they, they wanted to help their employees to have less pain. I think that's a great thing. Yeah, that's great. Well, of course, um, you know, they got your website. We'll put that up at the end, but we've run out of time. So I want to thank you so much, Diane. It's just been a pleasure to have you and to get all this great information out to our viewers, too. So. Thank you for having me, Tina. And we'll have you come back for the other issue with the shoulders and the neck. Oh, great, Tina. That yeah. would be great to talk about other things in the future. Thank mm -hmm. you. Alrighty. Well, I look forward to having you view other shows of Knowledge for Wellness, and I hope we have provided you with more knowledge to benefit you and your loved ones. So until next time, be well. And goodbye. Thank you. Over time you've healed so much in me And I am living proof That although my darkest hour had come Your light could still shine through And at times it's just enough to cast the shadow on the wall Though I am grateful that you shine Your light on me at all Who am I That you would love me so gently Who am I That you would recognize my name Lord, who am I That you would speak to me so softly Conversation with a love most high Who am I? Well, amazing grace, how sweet the sound That saved a wretch like me I once was lost, but now I'm found Was blind, but now I see and the more I sing that sweet old song, the more I understand That I do not comprehend this love that's coming from your hand Who am I? That you would love me so gently Who am I? That you would recognize my name Lord, who am I? That you would speak to me so softly Conversation with a love.